you ever want to remove the paint from an old boat or automobile? Today we're going to test out the Bauer Surface Conditioning Tool. We're going to remove the paint on this 1960 Lone Star. It has layers and layers of old paint built up on it. Welcome back to Decked Out John Boat. My name is Brett Cummings. I spent my life learning how to be a better angler and all about the boats that you catch the fish out of. That is way over here. I'm pretty sure that's the biggest fish. Good lord, Subscribe to the channel and learn more about boats and bass fishing. Assembly of the Bauer surface conditioning tool is pretty simple and straightforward. You attach the top handle with two Allen head screws. The screws and the Allen wrench are both included. This is the Bauer surface conditioning tool. It comes with three drums, 40 grit, 120 grit, and a 240 grit. You have two little keyways that go onto the spindle for the drum. Then you have a reverse thread bolt that holds the drum on. Let's just walk around and take a look at this thing. Got to admit, she has been loved. To be honest with you, I've never seen one of these boats with the original paint on it. I know they were white, so is this the original white color? With a blue stripe? Or is that one of the many repaints on this boat? Looks like it's been green, red, kind of a aqua looking color. It's been landed probably on a boat ramp so many times they had to weld this up. But all things considered, she's actually pretty straight. I think this tool is going to do great for all the flat surfaces, but like around the rivets and through here, I believe we'll have to maybe wire wheel that. But let's get to work and see how this tool works out. I'll start out with the most aggressive drum. That's maybe 10 minutes worth of work. There's still some, anywhere there's a den that has a hard time taking it off around these rivets. It's actually kind of sanding down the rivets. I don't know if I like that. I'll have to maybe stay away from them. Maybe. Not taking much off of them if it is. A lot of old paint to remove. Well guys, I'd say approved. 
probably got 80 or 90 percent of the paint off in a couple of hours had to uh, come back and get all the little detail stuff get the decals off I didn't want to gum up my drum definitely got better at using the tool as I went on able to get in between some of the rivets does really good on flat surfaces but you can see on this side I was trying to kind of figure everything out make sure you hit subscribe down below we'll get back on this thing see if we can get the rest of this paint off of here and uh, get to work on this thing